I'm just... <laughs> Are you ready? Let's go. I'm an entrepreneur, mom, wife, and friend. We will face fears, take risks, learn to love ourselves, and have fun. I believe in you, and my wish is for you to believe in yourself. We get one life. Let's play big, go places, and chase after our wildest dreams. I'm Liz Medley. Welcome to my world. So I have been home for less than 24 hours from a trip, nine day trip, and I am leaving again for six days. I'm headed out to California for a conference that I'm so excited for. It's gonna be awesome. Um, but I have a lot of mom guilt and wife guilt, um, especially mom guilt for being gone for so long. Even though I chose to go on the last trip and I'm choosing to go on this trip, um, that guilt is still there. And so this is when I really have to look at why I'm doing this business and um, why I want to grow myself. And that's when I can, it doesn't get rid of the mom guilt, but it reminds me that it's okay. And so I am getting out of here and I'm gonna take you guys with me. driver just picked me up and she's awesome she's from Brazil and um, she's taking me to the Marriott and we have so much in common we're both in the beauty industry um, she married a hunk I married a hunk they both look super young and it's awesome so yeah. <laughs> nice to meet you I made it to the hotel oh my gosh um, it's so weird. I always go to seminars with my friend Bobby and she is sick right now and so her doctors wouldn't release her. She is actually on the search for a kidney. She's on the kidney transplant list and it's just kind of a waiting game. Um, there's been some cities that we've gone to together to events and um, I'll sit through dialysis with her or, you know, help her back to the room or take extra notes for her because she's not feeling well. And so she's not here with me and I have an extra bed and ah, it's just not the same. It's just not the same with her not here. Wanna know something so freaking cool? Um, I work every day with a lot of people that I've never met in person and one of my amazing teammates that we met on Instagram um, got to know each other really well on Facebook lives in Northern California she's coming to pick me up and we are gonna go check out the Golden Gate Bridge and roam around San Francisco for the day I am so excited Look who just showed up, Miss Erica! Oh my gosh, we're going to San Francisco. Let's get out. Let's get out of here.
so many people from all over the globe. It is so cool to be around such high caliber, high caliber people. And not only just people, but entrepreneurs. Like this is like the cream of the crop and I'm so blessed to be able to be surrounded by them and to learn from them. But, ah, uh, I'm just, <laughs> Little Liz from Taylorsville, Indiana is mingling and wingling with some of the smartest people I've ever been around. And they're kind and genuine and have values. Ah, oh, I just love it. I just love it. So, in the back of my head over the years through personal development, I've had the question, and I've asked myself the question, you know, what's my purpose? Like what, who am I made to serve and really what is my purpose? And so, I came out to this training thinking that I was gonna learn um, some sales skills and some um, fundamentals and technical things. And what I've, oh, I have lipstick on my teeth. And what I have learned is so beyond that. Um, since I started doing personal development in about 2006, 2005, 2006, I've always kind of wondered like, what's my purpose? I know I have so much more to offer and give and so many more people that I can serve and a specific group of people that I wanna serve, but I could never quite figure it out. And I have gone in 100% committed to four or five things. And after this morning session, what I realized is, your purpose is not something that you find. You don't find your purpose. You make a decision. You make the decision and you move towards it. And it may take four or five different things that you've 100% committed at and that's when you're led to and you make the decision that this is what my purpose is. And it is also reassuring knowing that the time that I'm missing away from my daughter and away from my husband and being home, it's been worth it. It's been worth it. And ah, I'm just so freaking blessed. I am so, ah. Not only am I beyond blessed, I am on a mission to serve more people and help others, you know, face their fears, um, chase after their dreams, do things that they never thought was possible, and ultimately prove people wrong. Um, it's just gonna be awesome. Like, 2017 has been a freaking incredible year, but 2018, me and my tribe, we're coming for you. My time in California is over. It is the early morning. I am totally exhausted. I just called an Uber and I'm gonna go out here, catch it to the airport and get home to see my family. car and you guys it is so cold as much as I would love to enjoy this weather I know what's to come and it's even colder weather I can't handle this how how do I still live in Indiana yay I just pulled into my driveway and I'm so glad to be home Ruby <laughs> That's it. That's all you get. <laughs> all you get. Just watching Henry Danger. I see where I rank. But look, who else is here? Ah, hi. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here she comes, Miss America. You little turkey. Mm -hmm. I'm Liz Medley, and I believe in you. <laughs>